How did Billy Maximoff reincarnate? In the last episode of Agatha All Along, we could see how the true identity of the young man who accompanied Agatha through the Witch's Road was revealed. This is Billy Maximoff, one of the children of the Scarlet Witch, who was created during a psychological crisis of Wanda, but for some reason has been reincarnated in the body of another person. In this video, we will be trying to make sense of his reincarnation and see what will be his future in the Marvel Universe, as it could be the beginning of one of the most powerful heroes. And for more videos about your favorite series and movies, don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Welcome to the Oasis Geek. Before we start with this video, and to celebrate the arrival of the Penguin series, we will be giving away a Funko Pop from the Batman movie. To participate, all you have to do is subscribe to this channel and leave a comment telling us who is your favorite character from the DC Universe and why. The winner will be announced on October 31st. After Thanos ended Vision's life and Wanda Maximoff fell into a deep depression, she decided to use her incredible abilities to escape the pain by creating her own reality in a small town called Westview. In that place, Wanda not only recreated a perfect world, but she based it on the TV shows she used to watch with Vision when he was still alive. These shows represented for her a fantasy of happiness and stability, an ideal family life where the tragedies of the past didn't exist. Inside Westview, everything worked according to the rules of the sitcom she loved, with each episode representing a different decade of television. Using the magic of chaos, Wanda created an alternate reality within her world. A reality where Vision was alive and where she also had twin sons, Tommy and Billy. Her children also possessed supernatural powers, with Billy being the most similar to the Scarlet Witch. However, after Wanda confronted Agatha and realized that her family was not entirely real, she began studying the Darkhold and traveling between alternate realities. Wanda tried to steal the children of other versions of herself and became a villain, unaware that with her magic, she had actually created her children. In WandaVision, at first, we might think that Wanda had lost her sanity and that in her grief, she was creating people who didn't exist, as if everything that was happening was an illusion or a simple mind trick. However, Wanda Maximoff's abilities go far beyond simple illusions she wasn't just imagining a different reality. The magic she used, known as chaos magic, is a power that can literally alter reality. This means that when Wanda created her sons, Tommy and Billy, it was not just a fantasy in her mind. Chaos magic has the power to change the very structure of the world around her. So when Wanda imagined her sons, she brought them into the world in a way that made them real within the reality she was manipulating, we can say that she actually brought them to life. In the comics, Wanda used part of Mephisto's essence to create her children. We know that the magic Wanda wielded was so powerful that it attracted Agatha's attention, and the witches have also mentioned Mephisto on several occasions. It is possible that Wanda unwittingly used not only chaos magic, but also some of Mephisto's power to bring Billy's soul back to life. Remember that the Scarlet Witch's abilities are intuitive. She can use chaos magic without being fully aware of how she is doing it. Therefore, while she traveled between parallel realities looking for real children, Billy's soul that she herself had created ended up in the body of William Kaplan. William was a quiet young man who had a traffic accident. Just as he was passing through the town of Westview with his parents, the anomaly in that place caused Billy's soul to reincarnate in William's body. At that moment, William ceased to exist, and Billy took over his body. But then, how did he reincarnate? What I believe happened is that William actually lost his life in the accident, but the desire to protect Billy and Tommy was so strong that the Scarlet Witch's powers linked her son's soul to a nearby body. I think we are now just beginning to understand the magic of chaos, but it is much more complex than we thought. According to the comic book stories, the Elder Gods were the first to use sorcery 
and manipulate magic through the elements of the universe. It is possible that these same energies were responsible for allowing Wiccan to come back to life. But what does this mean for the future of his character? The first thing is that his arrival at Marvel will be that of an anti-hero. He's not a straight hero because he arrives by stealing someone else's body. Even Agatha jokes about this, telling him that she doesn't judge him for stealing that body. Therefore, Wiccan will be a character who could be morally gray in the future, willing to sacrifice certain things to achieve his goals. As the son of the Scarlet Witch, we will see how he will try to find justice. Wiccan has shown abilities that are practically identical to those of the Scarlet Witch, which already tells us that he has enormous potential. But that power also comes with a risk. Just as he can be an incredible hero, he also has everything he needs to become a villain. Controlling chaos magic is no simple thing, and we've seen that this kind of power can be tempting. Wiccan has the ability to change reality itself, but using that power carelessly could lead him down a dark path. If he continues to develop his abilities, he could become as dangerous as his mother, who started out as a heroine and ended up doing unthinkable things. In the comics, Wiccan is part of the Young Avengers, a group of teenagers who, like the Avengers, try to deliver justice. But perhaps Wiccan's destiny will be the same as his mother's, to start out as an anti-hero and at the end of his journey, become a villain. For the time being, I think Wiccan has been one of the most interesting characters in this series and the one with the most potential in the future, not only because of his connection to Chaos Magic and the Scarlet Witch, but because it is believed that he could become much more powerful. Perhaps in the future he will have to stop his own mother, but that's a theory for another day. Before we wrap up, there's an interesting news report that connects to the theory about Billy's soul. In the last few days, an update to the video game Fortnite has made a lot of buzz, as Mephisto has been added as a playable character. This could be another clue that at the end of the Agatha series, we could see the appearance of Mephisto. It seems that the hype has already started through these video games, making his involvement in the future of the Marvel Universe even more likely. But tell me, what do you think about all this? How do you think Wiccan was resurrected? Could it be that he used the Scarlet Witch's chaos magic? Will we get the comics explanation with Mephisto? Or do you think the explanation is simpler? And for more videos about your favorite series and movies, don't forget to subscribe to this channel. You are on. The Oasis Geek.